trigeminal neuralgia. It sounds scary because it is scary. It's actually labeled the suicide disease. I'm Dr. Zach Shaw with the Upper Cervical Spine Center and many patients in our office experience trigeminal neuralgia. And they come to our office because our office is their last hope, unfortunately. They've been everywhere. They've been to neurologists, pain doctors, all kinds of different doctors, and no one can figure out what is causing the trigeminal neuralgia. Trigeminal neuralgia is a severe condition where the face just feels like it's constantly in pain. Sometimes it's a pins and needle type of feeling, very sharp stabbing pains, burning sensations, and this can go all the way into the eye, into the teeth, into the jaw. A lot of times it happens out of nowhere. Sometimes it happens due to a specific accident. And it's called the suicide disease for a reason. People literally cannot live with this condition. They can't sleep, they can't function, they can't enjoy life. It's a terrible, terrible condition. And so when people come to us with this, you know, we, we feel so terrible for them. And we just wish that more people, maybe you, could find an upper cervical doctor so you could get the help that you need. Like I said, trigeminal neuralgia is characterized by severe facial pain. And the reason being is the trigeminal nerve, or the fifth cranial nerve, comes off of the brain stem and innervates the face. It has three branches that come together just like this, and that's why patients have facial pain. Whether it's on the top of their face or the bottom of the face, sometimes the entire face can be affected by this trigeminal neuralgia. So why do patients seek out upper cervical care? Why do we get amazing results with trigeminal neuralgia patients? The reason being is directly due to the brain stem. The nucleus of the trigeminal nerve starts at the brain stem. And the brain stem is surrounded by the top two bones in your neck. And so, when we see patients, we do an exam and we take x-rays on them, almost always we find an upper cervical misalignment or a misalignment in one of the top two bones putting pressure on the brainstem. In their case, it's affecting that trigeminal nerve. What we do is we locate that misalignment, we correct that misalignment to take pressure off the brainstem, thus freeing up the trigeminal nerve, and we see the trigeminal neuralgia go away. It's quite amazing stuff, and usually these people, I mean, they're crying from happiness because they're finally, finally rid of this ter terrible, terrible disease called trigeminal neuralgia.